Hey there, heroes, and welcome to Friday. Well, it looks like it's going to be maybe a frustrating Friday if you try to work against the winds of the universe, but if you go with the flow, things should be okay. We've got a temporary grand square in our hands today, really triggered by the moon in Virgo. Now watch the astral weather if you want to understand it in its entirety. But ultimately, it's lacking down four areas of our life, but allowing other areas to roam free. Aiding fuel to the fire, Mercury's at zero degrees today, which means that it's basically an honorary Mercury retrograde day. Not in the sense of losing our cell phones, but it's just very difficult for us to articulate or be real clear-minded. The universe is trying to shift the winds, basically, and push us in new directions. And for you, Aries, ultimately comes down to two major areas to focus on right now. One, being creative. Venus is ruling the day. The universe is really asking, I think, for everyone to just detach from any kind of outcome in the world and rather go more introverted today, particularly in a creative way. And for you, Aries, this all comes down to raising your prices, raising your value on the planet, raising your ability to make money, being creative about feeling better about yourself and raising values. That's where most of the creativity is focused for you. And this energy is tying into your place in society and also this inner artist is trying to be free. So it's kind of time to work on the inner artist in society but figure out how to make money or feel valuable doing it. That's today's spiritual homework. Then emotionally, the moon today has moved into Virgo like I mentioned earlier. That is the house of body and daily minor manifestation. That means your emotional consciousness and the consciousness of your body are merging right now. This does mean that if you've been under a lot of stress, your body is going to take a hit. This is a time where I see people manifest illness when they're not paying attention to their emotions. At the same time, however, having the moon in the sixth house really gives you a lot of passion into whatever work you're doing, particularly work out or investing in the body. So good time to invest in the body. Then over the weekend, probably Sunday, the moon will actually move into your opposite sign, Libra, which will really balance you out and maybe put you in the mood for some romance. All right, Aries, that's all we have for the weekend forecast. See you on Monday. Live, love, be. So garden, dot, tea.